Be on the lookout for this oil change scam as car manufacturers are working with big oil companies. As you can see in your owner's manual, it'll say of a Toyota possibly to use Mobile One 5W30 and change every 7,500 miles, 10,000 miles, or even more depending on the car manufacturer and oil company. Now, as you can see how this helps out the oil company because they're giving Mobile One an endorsement for using their motor oil. On the other hand, we have the car manufacturer. What do they get out of this? Well, you're going to wear your engine out. You're going to need a new vehicle and you're going to need more repairs. Not to mention these so-called free oil changes. So if you go buy a vehicle from say Toyota, unfortunately, they're going to change your engine oil that much less. So it's actually better for them to say, hey, come back every 7,500 miles, 10,000 miles. What about the oil company? Already named off one example of how they benefit, but that's not the only way. Well, when you're wearing out an engine, what's going to happen? You're going to use more oil. It's going to cause damage to the seals. It's also going to cause you to burn more oil. There's many ways these companies benefit just from doing this. Now, cars today definitely need great engine oil. You always hear, oh, the metal's better. Um, the oil's so much better. And yes, that's true. There are improvements. However, one of the great wear additives to the engine oil is zinc. Now, they've actually taken this out of the oil more and more over a period of time so it doesn't have as much wear protection in that aspect. Yes, they've made adjustments. However, this isn't enough, guys. This is a scam. Like I've been saying, you don't want to go for this. It doesn't help you in the long run. As a matter of fact, engine oil is that much more important today. With much tighter clearances, not to mention your fuel pump, you have one more than likely under the hood for a GDI engine because most vehicles are going to direct injection. So this is that much more stress on the vehicle. The performance of your vehicle is greatly affected by the engine oil as the variable valve timing is controlled by the oil. Well, that's not even to mention the carbon buildup issues, guys. There's been a lot of problems for the intake valves on these direct injection engines, not to mention these smaller engines that they're putting more and more pressure on using turbos and the oil is getting much, much hotter for these vehicles. So they're under a great amount of stress. And as you can see over time, if anything, they're starting to use cheaper parts. All this plastic and all this other garbage. I mean, yeah, there's some benefits, but there's definitely a lot of downside. If you don't believe me, go check it out for yourself. Do an engine oil analysis. What would I recommend? At least change your engine oil every 5,000 miles. That would definitely go a long way to help your vehicle last for the long haul because it's not really going to do you any good by the time you have to go out, buy another vehicle, spend tens of thousands of dollars more. This is just cheap insurance over the course of time. But as I said, hey, don't take my word for anything. I, I prefer you do not do that. Actually go out, spend you about 10, 15, 20 bucks, find a reputable um, oil analysis company such as Blackstone Lab or Choose Your Own, doesn't matter to me, and send it out and let them know, hey, what you want this tested for, the wear, et cetera, et cetera. Make sure you get a sample of the oil at whatever you want to change it at, say 10,000 miles or more, then get a sample of the oil at 5,000 miles and see does the wear increase over a period of time and it start wearing that much more or does it not? I mean, this definitely affects the performance and some of these seals, if you damage some of the seals such as the crankshaft seal or, hey, what about the timing chain? Most vehicles actually have a timing chain. This oil is very critical in protecting all these components within your engine this is something you definitely need to keep in mind over a few bucks. I mean, I would much rather use a cheaper brand oil and change it more often than use an expensive oil and change it once a year. Do what you want, guys. As always, hey, please, drop down, let us know what you think. What's your experience? As always, guys, thank you for watching Nate's Interactive Auto.